Hello guys, I'm gonna bring you a video that I never thought I would actually end up making, but hear me out. Ashihana came out, and of course I'm back on Iron Bar to try to grind for it. And as most of you guys realize that these items are insanely rare. No wonder the prices of these items, even after like 4 days, 5 days, is still in the billions, you know? Like a lot of the orbs and the armor pieces and the maze, they're still over a bill. And it's because they're brutally rare, like... This is, in terms of time investment, some of the craziest that RuneScape Grinds has ever gotten. Even crazier than Corp, I'll be honest with you. I'll give you an example. I've done 300 kills, and I've only seen two items. Yeah, that's crazy. That is crazy. And most people that have been grinding, like, as hard as I am, have been saying the same thing. And what if I do want to test out new items when it comes out in, like, the first week? The only way I can viably do that would be to buy it on a main account, right? So that got me thinking, in the future, if updates like this come out where items are so rare that it's not feasible for me to get it within a week on my Iron Man, then I should consider going on my main account and buying it and testing out for myself for like videos, for extra content, and also just to see, you know, have some fun with it and maybe give me more inspiration, more motivation to grind it on my Iron Man, right? After testing it out. So this brings me to a uh, pretty important revelation here. I have a lot of money Nani? in items, like value-wise, on Mr. Iron Bar and on Huang Man Raid as well. And a lot of these items in my bank are just placeholders. They don't do anything. They just sit there, you know, it's nice and makes the bank look beefy. But I've come to realize that I could get so much more benefit if I actually transfer some items over to my main account and actually be able to afford new items, expensive items on the first day or two or week, and actually be able to have some fun with it, test it out, make some new videos with it as well. This has made me realize that I should transfer some items over. And uh, I plan on transferring about two to three bill worth of stuff. Anyways, this will be a, I guess, a quick bank video. So not much has changed since the last bank video um i think <laughs> the price is pretty much the same you know give or take and uh, yeah i'm not gonna go through everything super in depth but uh here is the big items you know the big ticket items uh the raid stuff the slayer stuff the uh, god war stuff as you can see so a uh, big one three twisted bows uh spoiler alert, i'm not gonna be transferring these over because luckily for me twisted bows always maintain value it's always just been a bill you know for the longest time so i'm not gonna transfer that stuff but as you can see there's a lot of placeholders here some of these are definitely gonna get transferred because they are losing in value you know like dragon claws for example uh they used to be like 100 mil and you know now they've gone down to 50 mil and they might go down even more over time throughout the years but yeah man lots of good stuff here i'm gonna make sure i have at least two of everything in my bank just in case, you know, if I lose one or something, even after the transfer, I'll be fine. But yeah, pretty much all these things uh, are like the best of the best that you can get. They can be used everywhere and just cover everything, right? So yeah, quickly uh, scroll down here. Some miscellaneous uh, weapons and shields that I use sometimes. Some ammunition here. So yeah, a lot of uh, corpse stuff, a lot of God War stuff. Barrel stuff, alcohols. I won't be transferring alcohols because these are fixed price items, so they'll always be useful to me on my Iron Man. DK stuff here, lots of that getting transferred. Uh, yeah, more alcohols, more alcohols, mostly through Slayer and Bossing. And I already kind of prepped some of these items, so these are definitely getting transferred because their prices are always going down. So, yeah, this is going to be a hefty amount. But, yeah, that's that. So these are all the items I plan on transferring over just because, again, they're dropping in value and they will consistently drop in value as the game uh, progresses further in time. And yeah, it's a sizable part of my bank. Uh, it's about 2.7 bill because it was 13 bill, right, with all these things. So yeah, I can just double check, I guess. But yeah, let's just take away the deck scrolls and stuff. Uh, so that's 2 bill right there. Everything here. Uh, mostly the archer's rings and berserker rings, uh, raids items, some ancestral, some dragon claws, dragon hunter crossbows. Yeah, just things that I have so many of that definitely 
don't need that two bill and then this should be about 700 mil yeah 2.7 bill and my bank's still looking solid 10 bill and i still get to keep doubles of everything that i already have so yeah i plan on keeping doubles just in case if i lose them or something you know so we still have those but yeah the bank is relatively unscathed everything's still pretty much the way it is just without some of these uh, extra placeholders and I'm completely okay with that. All right, so I also want to liquidate a few things on Huaman Raid as well. Uh, honestly, just two things. The two things that has always been going down in price since the dawn of time. Yes, the Arcane Scrolls and the Deck Scrolls. So they will do me no good if I keep them here. They are going to keep dropping and dropping and dropping. Honestly, if you're curious, I'll show you the graph. You know, these things been out for years now, but you can see what I mean on this graph. Uh, how much we got for this? 400 mil? Sick. All right. So uh, we got 2.7 mil on iron bar and 400 mil on here. So my regular account is going to gain a hefty uh, 3.1 bill. That's going to be that's gonna be uh, fun. Yeah, I'm going to drop these too. Alright guys, we're about to get started. Uh, I have no idea why my main is scold. I don't remember what I did last time. But, yeah, whatever. Anyways, uh, yeah, I don't think anybody's really gonna know that I'm here. So, I'm just gonna quickly just, yeah, pick up stuff. <laughs> uh, it's kind of crazy though, but just making sure, you know. I gotta, I just gotta double check, you know, just in case I'm dropping, like, stuff that I, uh, I'm not supposed to, but I took a picture just in case so I can, like, you know, triple check. So, I guess I'm technically triple checking, but, yeah, this is it. Yep, it's been dropped. My main right here, the account that I uh, played when Old School first came out that I haven't played in forever, but, yep, same exact stuff, just on the regular account now so i guess i'll show you guys the bank on this before i basically sell all this stuff i, I plan on selling all this because i can always just rebuy it later on i'm sure the prices for most of these will be a lot lower you know as uh, supplies just come through this is what i have on this guy originally it's got 1.6 bill so clearly not enough money to really buy all the new gear and test it out because i need to just have some basic gear on this account for itself right Okay, now we're gonna do this for Juan Man now. So let's drop this and drop that. And voila, that is another uh, 400 mil. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and sell these. Uh... Wow, that's so fast. What the hell, all the archer strings sold so fast. Jeez, I didn't even edit the prices, okay. How about just sit your legs? Alright, none of these are selling. Uh, but yeah, I saw all the like pretty low level stuff. So all that I have left is the arcane scrolls and the deck scrolls and all the stuff here. So I already got 137 mil. I'm gonna leave these overnight though. And uh, yeah, I'll s hopefully sell them when I wake up. Let me log into my main once again or my Normby account. Oh my goodness. All right, guys, let's uh, check my Grand Exchange offers. Damn, 25 deck scrolls sold. <laughs> oh my god, look at that. One bill, just like that. And 86 mil. Wow. All right, guys, so we're at 1.9 bill from all the stuff that I sold, and there's three things left. Um, this is worth approximately about 900 mil. So I'll just wait one more day. I'm in no rush. I'll be back on it tomorrow. Hopefully these sell. No way. Oh, I totally forgot. it. Or actually, I was just not even thinking about the fact that, yeah, you can only hold regular wise 2.147. So actually, I would need to turn this into platinum tokens, right? All right. Uh, how do I do that? Banker? Enter your coins for platinum tokens. There we go. Ah, there we go. Now we have max cash and platinum tokens. So we're just going to have to sell these quite a bit lower and lose on a few more. But that's okay. That's okay. I'm not 
super mad about it or anything. So let's see here, 671 mil, 2.14. So that would mean I have 2.8 bill. So out of the predicted like 3 billion, I got about 2.8 bill out of that so that's that's fine with me because yeah i'm sitting at basically uh, close to 3 billion gp so what have i been up to other than this uh, shenanigans i've been working on ashihama and yeah just trying to get some drops on mr iron bar i'm not really sure how many videos i'm gonna do for mr iron bar for this update but i'm trying to get at least one or two you know with hopefully some items so that's what i've been doing just all day every day grinding ashihama dude so I hope to see you guys soon with another Mr. Iron Bar video. Um, yeah, man, as soon as hopefully I can get a drop. <laughs> Thanks for watching, though, man. I really hope you guys uh, enjoy this interesting video. You know, very uh, unusual video for me. But yeah, I will see you guys very soon, hopefully. Have a good rest of your day.